guys welcome and welcome back to the channel if you guys are new here hello hi my name is astra i hope you guys love it here i hope you guys enjoy it here and yeah i hope you subscribe at the end of this video or before the end of this video so today we have a team haul so let's get right into the video <laughs> all right guys so what you guys would have seen in the beginning is not my address so it's quite fine okay this is i use a third party shipping company to get these products down from the us to me and i ordered these products on the 1st of april and on the 19th of april is when i got my package so the shipping wasn't too bad at all um so let's see what is inside of this package all right so you guys know i don't prefer to waste a lot of time when it comes to hauls and stuff like that plus i like to talk a lot okay so let's not focus here so i'm already seeing what's in here so let's pull this one out and this is what we have summer is coming up so i made sure to order some bacon nice okay i'm not gonna throw these on for you okay okay <laughs> i may or may not insert some photos for you guys but for sure i will leave the links down below if you guys are interested in getting these items so first thing first i heard about timo a couple of months ago um and i was like what is that affordable so i went and check it out and then i was like why is it that affordable like is it really that affordable and the quality of the products that the person was showing online wasn't too bad you know and so i was like i think Najee, 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 i think is her name um is where i saw her talking about them so then i was like okay cool eventually at some point in time i'm gonna order you know try it out and see how the products look so then a couple weeks later, Teresa, I was like, Astra, you need to check out this place. And she sent me um, the link to the place, which was Timu also. I told her, yup, I, I, I saw it. I'm definitely on it. So thank you very much, um, Teresa, for looking out for your girl. So let's see what this bikini looked like. Now, I'll, like before taking it out of the package, the quality looks pretty good. All right, so let me show you what it looks like. I don't know how, whoa. Nothing bad. I'm just shocked. Um, okay. I don't know how the bottom looks, honestly. I just know how, like, the back of the bottoms, I don't know. I just know how the top looks. And let me show you. Whoa, look at the quality of the material. Yeah. Uh, the pattern. Can you see how thick that is? Look at the inside of the... Oh! I am shocked, sir. Okay, I got a large, yeah, because um, based on the measurements that were for each size in, I believe a large would have fit me much better. Um, and I wear, my cup size is a D. Yeah, she's fitting, she is fitting. I do have a black bikini, but I had that for eons. Honestly speaking, I had that for years. So I said, let me just get another black one. And I was actually gonna check out but then it suggested um, this bikini along with another one. And I was like, hmm, I actually like this bikini better than when I was in my court. So I took that one out and put this one in. I am not disappointed. So um, you would tie this part here around the neck, as you guys can tell. And on top of that, you have this little accent right here. Oh, girl. Oh. And uh, this is tied around here. I don't know if it's supposed to go around your stomach. Wait, hold on. Let me take these extra ones out of the way so you can understand what I'm showing you. This is tied right here in the center and i don't know why it can easily be removed yeah but i don't know why it's tied there i don't know if it's supposed to probably it's supposed to go like around underneath the bust and around the back probably but i find that with my shape it tends to roll up and i don't like i don't look cute but i'll try it out and see and then you have the one that would normally tie around this side like under the bust and around the back so yeah this girl <laughs> All right, calm down. <laughs> Phew. All right, let's look at the bottoms. Because like I said, I don't know if it's a thong. I don't know what the bottom is. Okay, it's cheeky. It's very cheeky. All right, cool. This, this is what the front of the bottom looks like. Okay. And it has the extra piece in between the middle 
right there. You guys can see that. And the front is as big as the back, okay? <laughs> Just a, the back is a little bit bigger. And it has a protective section right here in the um, liner, the panty seat area. It says um, protection, oh, hygienic protection. Let me see. Okay. The material in here is that, that is that material you would expect for the liner of the inside. Oh, I am shocked. For the inside of... <laughs> the um bikinis bought bikini bottom like how oh. and this was not you guys know i like to put y'all on okay and let me tell you who i use to ship my products i use aeropost and i was looking for another company that was you know not as expensive but i've not found one as if you guys know if after you've checked out aeropost you know of another that is a little bit cheaper let me know you guys know i'm always on a hunt i'll save some coins okay always on a hunt to save coins so I am in shock. Whoa, you know when I get to the beach. You know when I get to the beach next. Is <laughs> yeah, yeah. It look a bit large um, for me though, but I'm gonna say that, and then when I put it on, it's gonna fit is that. Uh, so yeah, I uh, girl, this is this is large to me, but I usually wear my um, bikinis low. When I say low, I mean I don't have it curved up like how like the women are wearing it now. I don't wear it like pulled up and straight. I wear it pretty low because my torso is very long and the my shape is like the curve in my my waist, the descent in the curve. You know how you got like an hourglass shape and you got the curve? Right, my curve is not high up. My curve is, is my curve is very low. So to accentuate that curve and to make it look a little like stuff popping, okay, when we're on the beach, I like to wear my bikinis low and straight. Yeah, or well, let's I've not come out come out of that as yeah, but yeah, girl. I am a press in. Okay, I'm impressed with this. And it came in this little baggie right here. Wow, I am in shock and awe. All right, so let's move on quickly to the next piece because I don't want this to be super duper long. Okay. Put in my hand in. Let's feel for something. Wait, hold on. I'm trying to find something different because I know what's on the top. Okay, found something. Mm. And this is what we have. Ta da! A bag. Alrighty. Let's open this together. Guys, I've not, I've not taken a peek at these. This, I got this in yesterday. And I was like, you know what? Don't look. Just, we will do this on camera. So, this is really a first impression as well. Alright, so I got this um, pink bag. Ooh, it looks quite cheap. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Sister Honey Girl. Mm hmm. It looks quite cheaply made. I'm not gonna make any excuses and be like, oh, for the price, what do you expect? No, I, I don't care. It looks cheaply made. It looks cheaply made. Let me, let me put it in on a little, little. Okay. Let me, let me fix it up a little. All right. Boom, boom. All right. And the strap. Can this turn? I, I fear to turn this strap because I feel as if it will, um, what do you call it? Rip it. So this is how the strap is. It's like a literally a piece of material. A piece of material. Ah. Oh, it has a little strap on the inside. I think you may have to tie this through. Let's see. All right, first let me show you with oh the strap. Oh, like this has no body or no shape. I absolutely prefer my bags to have a structure, like to have a structure. This looks like just material that they cut out and put together. Yeah, I'm not 100% pleased with this one, um, but it's it's workable, I guess. I just pray these these straps don't tear, like. Hmm? So this is it. Oh, I don't know why it's like a little cocked up, but this actually doesn't look bad like right here because it looks as if it has structure, but because it's just material that has been sewn together, this is what we're getting. I don't know. This handle has me so scared. Like it's twisted here. As you can see, it, it pushes more forward. It turns more forward than the other. I really, really think it's supposed to be mostly this way. And I'm okay, it can turn. It can turn. Let me turn this one. Ooh, this one is a little tighter. God be with your child. Okay, hey. 
All right, that is gonna do for now. <laughs> yeah, this is that. Um, will I repurchase this? I will say no. Okay, let's uh, try to put the strap together. So it's just a material. This actually feels like the firmest thing yet because it's folded over. All right, I'm going to knot this. And then I'll show you how I um, put it in. And obviously you can make this as long or as short as you want it to be. So I just pushed it through these two holes here in the back on the inside and tied it. Let's, mm -mm. nope, will not be repurchasing one of these. And then you can have a long straw. As I said, you can make this as long or as short as you prefer. I mean, it's a crossbody. Um, if you don't prefer it with, with the strap, then obviously you would take it without the strap or hold it like this with the strap, the longer strap, entirely up to you. But you see this handle? Oh, girl, I know I'm not gonna really take it um, anywhere with a lot of anything in it, but girl, uh, this, the strap. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Let me fold this side in just to hold the other one is folded. All right, but on camera, it doesn't look bad. <sighs> So this is the second item. Cool. Let's move on to a third. Mixing it up. This is another. This is a bikini. All right, I saw this bikini down here. I'm gonna start on Timo. I was like, yeah, let's get it off Timo because down here I think it was seventy-five dollars because this is a three-piece, and I think on Timo it was for sure less than ten dollars. I'm quite sure it's less than ten or twelve dollars. Not a lot. So I was like, yeah, let's get it on Timu. So then I was looking at the reviews of it and the colors didn't match that with what was in the photo of that will represent these pictures. The, the, the persons who purchased it, their photos. So I was like, hmm, I just, just hope that it is as vibrant. And boo, it is as vibrant. It is as vibrant. I don't know if the camera actually looks washed out, but here in person, I would say a little wash, and then I go back and wash footage. It looks just as bright as it's supposed to. So yeah, let's take a look at this one. I got this in a size, another piece of uh, tissue, another piece of tissue. I got this in a size large. All right, let's see the top. Okay, it has the pattern here on the inside. The pattern is different from the other pattern that we saw earlier. Yeah, this is what the pattern looks like on the inside. If it twists or anything, I can also put your finger in here and adjust it. Um, the straps for the neck, or if you're one of those persons who will flick their bikinis, it will be a strap for under your um, bust area around the back. And let's do this the normal, traditional way. All right, so this is for the above as usual. And this is for the below. Oh, I thought I heard like elastic popping because that would be like it's an old bikini so yeah this oh my shocking oh so oh ready for summer so that's the top let's see the bottoms okay these are not cheeky bottoms at all cheeky bottom cheeky bottom but the front is a little small you know so it's gonna fit you nice honestly it's gonna fit you nice if mary is a little bit then <laughs> you already understand and this is the back of it it really does look washed out haha there you go you can see the vibrancy of this bikini the colors i really hope this is not too big though like i really hope that the crotch area because I, uh, like i said i wear my bikinis lower down so then obviously the crotch area will be shorter and if the bikini is a lot it will be um a little looty so let's hope not and this is the third piece this is the cover up here this is the top of it so it has elastic here in the waist and coming down on the thigh, you have this drawstring section here. So you can draw this to as tight as you want it to look, yeah? Um, or as short as you want that little section there to be, which will also affect the shape of the skirt. Ooh, isn't this cute? Cute, cute, cute. Um, um, mm -hmm. so far the bikinis yeah definitely this is like a size large i am super impressed super impressed 
All right, I bought only four products because this is just a test, oh, I, and in total I spent 50 Barbados. All right, final product is this white bag. All right, <sighs> let's spray. All right, this. Should be opening from here, don't worry. Okay, it's not bad. Oh, this one has a lot more structure than that other one. This is what it looks like. Yeah, I like this. Oh, it has stuff on the inside, that's probably why it feels more structured. But I guess. I'm not making any excuses. That one was a little flimsy. But obviously, the more you fill your bio, the more structured it will be. But mm, I shouldn't I shouldn't have to be on, on um filling or filler or whatever. So yeah, guys, this is what it looks like. I like this one. This one is cute. I really this is about one. Six to eight inches though. Um long you guys know I don't really do big, big bags. I'm gonna try to get into that that though, like getting big bags all right let me see if i can open this up oh yeah yeah, yeah. that's simple that's easy all right cool oh okay wait 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 hold on so wait let me open it first oh girl all over the place so right here is actually black yeah and this is actually the lock for the bag the lock for the bag all right so let's open it up see it has um stuffing on the inside but it is aligned so it's a much better make than that other bag that we um, just um, opened up. Okay. I'm definitely going to pop that right back in here. And it has... Um, this seems to have been another bag that was for the air, actually. I don't know. It has a chain that you can hook on it as well. Oh, let me, let me show you up close. This is what the chain looks like. Hold on. Let me do what I did better. Can you see that? Yeah, you can. Good, good, good. That's what the chain looks like. And it's not a really long chain either. Yeah, so you can make this as long or as short as you want it. Oh, I was looking at uh, looking for the opening. So let's um, uh, add the chain to it. <clears throat> the same way how I did the other one. So I'll put both in through these holes this bag this is actually not i won't say this is a solid weight this is actually a pearlescent um weight if you want to make it shorter if you want to make chain shorter you would just attach it further and uh, further down the um length of the chain if you want it long you would just attach it further and further up so let's just put it at its um, longest length for now yeah let's close this but you see without anything on in it it looks flat and bleh. Yeah, so maybe with the other one, we just have to fill it in with stuff and go from there. So this is how, actually, wait, hold on. Let me make it look good. Let me keep my happiness up. <laughs> All right, so this is how you lock this. this I like this one. I'm not, I'm not, not pleased. This piece is that's a this piece. I'm happy with this bag. So this is how you will lock it using this little piece here and you'll push that through. Oh. All right, and this is the length of the bag. Nice, I like it. I absolutely love this. And if you wanna make this chain thicker as well, instead of just going through once, you can probably go to go through twice or go through three times and you will get, um, something that looks like this. Let me show you it quickly. Yeah, so you have two chains here instead of one. And the more you go through the hoops, the shorter your chain is gonna become. I think that would have been obvious. Um, but just, just letting you know, because I come, up. Based on my job, girl, I realize that certain things, as much as I'll say they're obvious, clearly are not obvious to some people. So this is what it looks like with, and this is the length that you will have as well with two 
drawers are two going 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 in twice this piece here definitely supposed to be on the inside but either ways yeah guys that is it let me bring i don't know if i when i brought it earlier you guys were able to see the pearlescence of the bag i hope you guys can see it that is not like solid wood it has a pearlescent finish to it i love this one though honestly i really really do like this one i really do like it Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's you know, it looks like a sponsor to me. It looks except the chain, but <laughs> it still looks expensive. I absolutely love this class. So oh, I don't Okay, so uh there are actually vendors on there. So where I bought these two bags from, they're from two different vendors. Let's say that. And so always read your reviews before you purchase anything. Um, some persons may say, oh, it fit true to size. Some persons will say, oh, it didn't fit true to size. Size up, size down, whatever. Um, keep in mind the material as well that you're going to order. Because if you're going to order something that loosely fits, you're going to not necessarily order it in your size unless you want it to be like oversized. If you want it to fit bigger or, you know, you will size up, size up. I hope I'm making sense. Just depends on the material, depends on the fit and read the reviews look at the dimensions as well please because i was so hesitant of seeing this bag when i saw that the dimensions i think the dimensions said it's going to be six or seven inches i was like oh my gosh that's like yeah big um but it's it's a good size to me yeah so yeah guys i um i'm putting you on i'm signing up with what do you call it air post it's not difficult i'll leave a link down below also for you all and this brings us to the end of our, um, I guess, Timu haul. Will I be purchasing for them again? Girl, <laughs> yeah, y'all. I spent 50 Barbados dollars plus shipping. The shipping for this, though, was actually free. So you only had to pay for freighting from, um, for Aeropost. And that was it. And it was not a lot of money, actually. So would I repurchase from Timu? Definitely, yes. Please and thank you very much. I probably have an order in by the time you see this video, <laughs> to be quite honest. And um, yeah, I am going to uh, uh, keep putting you guys on on certain finds that I have. I have a inexpensive foundation review coming for you guys, so stay tuned for that as well, okay? All right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. From Barbados to you with all my love. Bye, guys. Don't forget to hit that circle button to subscribe to my channel and here are two more of my videos. See you soon!